Are we back or what? Oh my gosh, Origin. Please, thank you. Welcome to the episode of Damage TV. This is Damage Create. So we back with another video, back with another review. Today we are going to be reviewing something that I have been using for quite a while. Even though I have some already, I just need another set. And today I have it. We got some new brushes from Amazon. It's from a company called Mary Nice. And we're going to, um, we're going to review these brushes today. Because they were supposed to be coming in July. Okay. These came early. These were right on time. It only took like three days for these to come. Three days. Now I will tell you why I'm going to review these brushes. I haven't done a review in so long. I've been, I was trying to like, you know, hold off doing any videos because I wasn't active on this, on the second channel. And the reason why I wasn't so active as I once was, um, when I first started doing this channel, probably because I wasn't really interested in doing reviews anymore. But now that I'm getting new items, you know, like brushes and things like that, I'm going to be doing more reviews and better reviews um, this up upcoming weeks. Because June is getting ready to be over in a few hours, and July is on its way. And yeah, I'm feeling the effects of it. Anyway, let's go ahead and review these brushes and get started. So before we get started, I wanted to talk about these brushes. This is a makeup brush kit premium 10 piece um, kit that I got from Amazon. The original price list was $12.99. Um, I only paid $3.90 for this and the shipping was free. So thanks to Vipon, I was able to get this uh, free shipping and pay a smaller uh, cheaper price so for all the needs that you so if you want to get like the best of quality without paying so doggone much head over to vipron.com and you will definitely get it all right let's go ahead and get started so I'm going to randomly pick out a brush before I go any further I'm going to show you what the brushes look like these are what the brushes look like. All of the pieces together. And um, we're going to we gonna do them all. We're going to. Okay. So it's like a little. Something I want to try that. So let's start with. Oh my gosh. I love this one. So this one is the powder brush. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, if you see some of my makeup tutorials, I've been using a foundation brush as powder, a, a powder brush. You know, especially when I set my makeup. So this is actually a great brush to use. I love the thickness of the handle. I also love the design of it. It's almost like a mahogany type of wood. And I love, look at these. Oh my gosh, look at these hairs. These are really fine hairs. I believe these are synthetic. But either way, they feel really soft and they look absolutely amazing. Just absolutely gorgeous. Like each hair is a soft texture it doesn't feel rough it doesn't feel like like the top is like dry and crusty with filled with glue it's an actual good looking brush and this looks good for some powder for a powder brush for real okay next up we have a blush brush um absolutely gorgeous i love this this blush brush because you can definitely go down, when, especially when you're contouring and things like that. So this is also a good contour brush. So I could definitely see myself using this. Oh, wow. And once again, these hairs are absolutely gorgeous. What I'm noticing is, is that some of these hairs are different colors. You're not going to see with this camera. But some of these hairs are like different colors, but it's just gray all around. You're just going to see that it's gray all around. Or you can kind of see it, especially in this yellow lighting, because this is like crazy it's terrible lighting i'm sorry but you know that's the price i pay for getting a desktop but yes this brush has like 
different colored hairs, but it's just gray throughout with white on, like a nice little lighter gray on top. Next, we have, I want to show you guys the sponge right here. This sponge, I didn't think it was going to come with this, but this is, wow, this is like a little mini beauty blender. It's a beauty blender on a brush, but they call this a sponge foundation brush. So maybe I could possibly use this to do my foundation um, with. Absolutely gorgeous. I love the roundness of it, and I love that it's more like a like a nice little gumdrop, cute little gumdrop, and the tip is awesome. Compared to my beauty blender, this is some this is something most definitely needed, and the handle is absolutely nice. I like the handle. All right, let's see. So we did powder, we did blush, we did. Oh, let me show you these small brushes right here. So the small brushes I have is an eyeliner brush and pretty much a basic little brush, I believe. Or is this something else? Let's see. Yeah, this is the little brush. So this could be like used like a like a lip brush. But this eyeliner brush, I might not use this because I'm so used to using the brush that comes with the eyeliner. But these are pretty good brushes as well. And the hairs on these are just really defined, nice and cut. And things like that. I'm surprised it's not a flat brush in here. I think the only flat brush in here is the foundation brush. Let's see. Why they did that? Yo, let me show you guys a foundation brush though. This is actually pretty nice. If you layer on your foundation like just as so, you could actually get a, a good um, look going. So like I said, the hairs are different colors like amongst this area here but it's gonna be great throughout this one like a light gray almost like a salt pepper look just like with different like little highlights but let's keep them let's see oh this is something i needed this is a eyebrow and lash groomer tool now i do believe that this is for the lashes and this is for the eyebrows because this is like a nice little fine tooth comb and it looks really nice i love the curving of it and i i love that it's kind of definitely transparent instead of just like you know just something like ugly off coloring but this is a really nice um transparent you can definitely see my finger through the brushes and through the comb so this is pretty nice and i love the shaping of the of the handle itself along with these brushes. Let's see. They it came with an eyebrow brush. Is it in here? I oh, know here it is. Look at this eyebrow brush. Now I'm expecting to get some like a sample of um, some eyebrow gel. Hopefully I'll be able to get it and do it for another tutorial but check out this eyebrow brush it'll ah, i needed this one like because bruh let me see oh yeah this is a good eyebrow brush it looks really nice i love each bristle looks absolutely freaking amaze balls so this is a great eyebrow brush so yeah, let me just pull out all of these so you guys can see it. Just the oh, let me show you this one. This is the um another okay. So this one is the little brush here, and the one I probably picked up was the eye shadow brush. But wow, this looks really good. Compared to my brushes that I got from eBay, these are some pretty good brushes. Because the brushes that I got from eBay were like pretty much samples. Here's another eyeshadow brush. So it came with, I believe, two eyeshadow brushes. Oh, wow. Look at the hairs on these bad boys. Like, these are, these are to me, these are professionals. Though. But yeah. But like, when it comes to makeup gurus, they always want like the hugest brush set to me. Just give me these brushes and I'm good to go. Overall, this is a 7 out of 10. And the reason why I want to say 7 out of 10, and I took away 3 points because 
um, maybe just of the, of the, of the off coloring itself because you can definitely tell that it looks like off coloring on the picture like you can definitely tell like, that's, I wish I could show you the picture too I don't know if I can show you the picture but yeah you can definitely tell the, the, the off coloring maybe I'm just maybe I'm just not into everything being three multiple different colors maybe I'm just into like one color but oh, either way it's still a great set I absolutely love these these are so long. I cannot wait to use this powder brush. I really want to use it for foundation, but I already have like a foundation brush going. And let me just talk about this bag. I love pink. Pink is so cute. It came with these bags, this bag. Each of these were individually wrapped. That's even more professional. The box was a little bit damaged, but it, it's all right. But yeah. Fresh. 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 Okay, let me stop being weird. That's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Click the notification bell. We know if I have all my videos. Check the signal notification box. That way you'll be getting all my notifications, not just some. And, uh,. I think I'll do a live tutorial probably 4th of July or something. But anyway, I will see you all next time.